what I like about St. Augustine is it just has that old Florida feel to it. It's like real Florida. I love living here. There's a lot of times where it'll be small for a while, but when we do get good waves, there's not a whole lot of other places I'd rather be. There's actually a lot of uh, really fun days over here and a lot of people are really dedicated to it. There's still some spots here where it's like, you can still get good days uncrowded. If you can surf here, and the downside of in between when there's no waves, that kind of short interval surfing, when you actually get on a perfect wave face or something that's really good, they usually shine, you know what I mean? Because they just have an eye for finding sections where most people couldn't. Nice. I've fished this since 1967. And how long have you surfed it? Over 50 years. Hell yeah. October be 51 years. It's the life. I mean, if there's no waves, there's always fish if you know where to go. Yeah, there's no two ways about that. Yeah, I agree with you there. Either the river or the ocean. holding our first duct tape festival in Florida, and we figured it was kind of fitting that we should probably go to Justin's hometown. We've got a lot of history here, uh, culture, which is what the festival is all about. In the United States, it's the other half, you know? It's like California, you have one half, on the East Coast, you have the other half, so it's good to kind of visit both sides of it so you kind of get a bigger picture of like surfing in general where you live, you know? It's just bringing people together to share the good vibe of surfing and the love of surfing and riding different surfboards and a lot of fun. What surfing is all about is fun. So when I was growing up, there were actually some pretty good longboard contests that were organized. So I got to see surfers kind of from all over. That's one thing now that there's not a whole lot of, there's a lot of young kids coming up that are surfing really good right now in Florida. And I think just like experiences like this can help lead someone in the right direction or just be a good influence on them. So I think it's great that the band is bringing this to North Florida. And a lot of people are really excited about it. hand-shaped boards that are brought here. We're gonna let the community and anyone coming through St. Augustine come and ride the boards for free. Just take them out, ride them, have a good time. It's just such a great thing and, and we're so happy to be a part of it.